Hello everyone, welcome to K-pop Queen Fear Not Daily Reactions to all things K-pop. Okay, I was supposed to do these videos like a week and a half ago, two weeks, maybe even three weeks ago. Ah, it's been a hot minute. Sorry. Um, I just got really, really busy. I went to go see Beyonce twice. That's really what it is. I went to go see Beyonce twice. Um, I had to prep for that. So you know. Oh, <laughs> had an amazing time at both concerts, by the way. If you have the chance to go see her, make sure you do. But let's talk about another female solo artist right now. Okay, Miss Zio. She is here with her first solo album called Zone. In the zone. Come on now. You know what I'm talking about. All right, it's got seven tracks on here. That's a nice little mini. That's a scrumptious little snack. Okay. We got two features on here too, which is pretty nice. I didn't know about that. Um, our lead off of this is Killing Me Good, which I'm still bumping. I'm still I'm still listening to that. I'm sure you are too. Um, I'm ready to listen to this. I I I seriously, I have been wanting to listen to this for weeks now. Um, so I'm really glad that I have the time to do this right now. So um let's check it out. Yeah, let's get into it. Okay, first track on here, Killing Me Good. Yeah. It's just a little walk up, a casual little da da you know? That tone, that tone. Yeah. Uh -uh. You're killing me, killing me good. Uh -uh. my voice so i really can't hit these notes okay i could have before but now i really can't yeah <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, that's a that's a lead single. Yeah, that's a that's a single for, for, for an album. Yeah, 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 yeah. She looked phenomenal in the video, gave me good choreography, gave me good vocals, gave me everything that I really wanted, honestly. And what I would expect from her sound wise, uh look wise, you know? I do truly, truly enjoy this song. And to this day, I don't know what the netizens are talking about. It's a it's a haterade. They 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 sip it on haterade over there. Okay, I don't know. Next track on here is talking about you. They love a little apostrophe. Forget the I and G. We just I and apostrophe. Okay. <laughs> talking about it. Featuring 24, you know, carat gold. 24. Damn, hold on. Featuring 24k golden. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's check it out. Wait, what's to be? Hold on. Up in my face. Okay. Up in my space. Life got me working for a clean slate. Hey. Lose my mind. Yeah. Until you come by. Yeah. We can be done with all this bright light. Bright. We are. Too loud. We could have been a thing to talk about. The composition of the chorus, though. Oh, oh, oh. 
and then bring it. Mm. Weave that. And then we get this little drum pattern. Yeah. Oh, 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 <laughs> and then, oh, 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 okay, yeah, okay, 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 okay. The, the composition of the song actually really, really intrigues me. It's really scratching a certain part of my brain. There's so many different drum patterns, beat patterns. At one point, I was like, okay, this kind of, this is a little bit of an Afro beat drum. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Don't, don't, a tiny, okay? I felt that. I felt that rhythm. But then they give me that dance in the chorus. And I knew it was going to be a dance track, but I wasn't sure what kind of dance, you know? So, so the fact that they gave me that kind of dance, I was like, okay, they stripped that out. Keep it mellow. Give us a little oh, 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 for two eight counts. We don't even elongate that. That's really just, a, that was just like a little surprise, a little teaser. Some for the girls. You know, something to snack on, something really light. Before we go straight back into that dance. Uh, so many elements to this song. I feel like there's like one, you know, pattern you could follow, you know, a different time. Each time you listen to the track, just something different each time. Next track in here is Closer. I just can't leave you alone. Mm. Can we get even closer, babe? Yeah. Closer. Yeah, we can. You won't be just mad. Oh. They they layering, they layering. The muted drum pattern, the muted uh, doom, doom bass. That was the last line. <laughs> I was expecting another get get closer, but that's okay. That's okay. End the track. It's over. You know, let's let's settle the track. Okay, I get that. Sensual, sexy, um, muted, muted. Okay, that drum, the the bass, that her vocals even. She's not really pushing. <laughs> She's really not. Um, keeping it kind of lower on the register as well. Next track on here called Wishing on You. Mm -hmm. Okay, I am hearing a phone. I was like, why the fuck I hear a phone? It's coming from my speaker, that's why. Hold on. Tell me my every distraction. 
What's your emergency? Yeah, I just listened to Wishing on You by Gio. Send an ambulance! She wants to go into cardiac arrest! Like, what? Wow. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. R&B, sexy, good melody, love that upper rasp. Ah! Oh! That chorus is honestly, is honestly what a, a singer could wish for. I'm not even kidding. Like, you really wish you could have a fucking chorus like that, with a melody like that, with a vocal like that. Come on, R&B. In all English, too? Yeah? Yeah, I think so. Most, I think most of it has been in English. Yeah, most of it has been. Um, you know, not completely, but most of it. Ho! Oh, wow. That's a hidden gem right there. That's a B-side right there. Next track on here. Don't want to go back. Duet with Hayes. Come on. This every... <laughs> Buckle the fuck up. Yeah. Come on, B. vocals the vocals weaving come on Yeah. 
A little, uh, a little emotional mid-tempo ballad. Kind of what I thought it would sound like, honestly. That's kind of what I was figuring the sound would be with Hayes. You know, <laughs> this is her sound, right? Good melody. They sound good together. I could imagine them doing this stripped back with just like an acoustic guitar. I could, I could really see that happening. Like them up on stage or like doing like a little video for YouTube or something. I think that that could be cute. Doing a little live stripped back version of don't want to go back vocals on this were weaved together so perfectly not 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 stacked weaved sewn right into each other so good they had great harmonies that they would do themselves right just right on top of each other but just really light volume turned down really quiet but still there still adding flavor still adding texture to the track okay next track on here is called room Oh, monologue happening? What's going on? <laughs> okay. I was going to say, there's a little bit of an emptiness to this track, and then that guitar comes in, fills it up. Violin? describe this there's there's an emptiness in this song and there's a dreaminess about it and when those two come together it, it kind of like feels a little like it feels a little off it feels a little off you know um I don't know I, I maybe this song was meant to calm her but it makes me a little unsteady listening to it I don't know it, it gives me a certain like sadness there's a sadness to the song that I'm hearing you know but I don't know if she meant it that way. I honestly, listening to her sing it, I, I feel like she meant it to be more peaceful. This is her room, the room she's in. I'm going to be come back to this room. A safe space, a home. I don't know. This is why I need to learn Korean so I can also get the lyrics about it. You know, I get a better vibe than just music. Hmm. Okay, last song on here. Nightmare. You know what? Maybe it wasn't meant to be. A safe space th the room maybe she's having nightmares in this room i don't know let's see okay let me just listen because where are we going Okay. 
okay 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 background and then this explosive chorus I'm your nightmare. Oh, I thought she was saying she was getting nightmares. No, she haunting someone else. My God. Okay, the composition of this kind of confuses me. Let me be honest. We have these like, <laughs> these big drums, do 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 do, like fucking Seal himself came in and put on the song, right? My God, these loud ass drums, right? Those synthy chords, distorted synthy chords in that pre chorus, that very explosive pre chorus. And although I think the term or the word nightmare is, is being used very accurately to describe this song. I do think they created a song that sort of could be like a nightmare in itself, right? You kind of get lost in it. You're, you don't really know what's happening. Okay, sure. I I don't know. I don't think I would have put this on the album. I'm not saying it's a bad song, although does do I want to keep listening to this? No, because composition sort of confuses me. I just don't think it fits with this album, given what we already got. Room in itself was kind of a little stray away, but not really, but not really, right? Yeah, we get dance, we get R&B, then we go to Haze, we get that mid-tempo ballad, then we get a, like a really proper ballad, right? With Room. We could have ended it right there, or you could have added in another R&B track if you wanted to. You know, if you really felt like you needed seven songs, I do think Nightmare is a little off-putting, and I don't think it really fits. Okay, Miss Jiho Zone, our first album. I think that this was great. I think that this was a really great display of her as a solo artist. I love the song that I got from her, Minus Nightmare. Um, but everything else, I'm like, incredible, amazing, yes, good, check, 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 correct. She gave me good range. She gave me good vocals. She gave me a variety of tracks that I would want to hear from her, a sound that I honestly would expect from her. So I do think it's very fitting. I do think she sounded really good. Um, and I think she set herself up for success, honestly. You know, I don't know when we're going to get another one. I don't, I really don't know how this works with Twice if everyone releases something or, you know, only a couple of them do the solos, a couple of them in the subunits, something like that. Um, either way, I, I am anticipating another album from her. I am anticipating some more tracks from her. Um, I, I'm a huge, huge fan of her. I think she's such a strong singer, dancer, performer that... It would sort of be a shame, in my opinion, if she doesn't keep doing this, you know? Um, Zone was good, though. Wishing on you. Actually, my favorite track on here. Um, and I love the duet with Hayes. I thought that that was so beautiful. Um, I would love to hear more duets with her. I would love to see her, you know, come up with other solo artists. Give me a dance performance, too. So there's, there's a lot she could do. She could really do it all. So definitely push her. Give me that purse, um, as I think you have done. Yeah. Guys, what did you think about this? You've had this for weeks. <laughs> okay. Tell me your opinions on Zone. Come below, tweet at me, and I'll be back with another reaction. Bye, guys.